Hey YouTube, how's it going? It's Mark again, and welcome back to the Swamp and Stomp YouTube channel. Today I'm starting a new project I'm really excited about. Me and Danny have been talking for quite a while about building electric fat tire bicycles that we can use to get all of our gear and our, our deer in and out of the woods um, so that we can hunt on public land more effectively. Uh, we finally pulled the trigger on those. Danny bought a ready-built uh, bike. He got the uh, Rad, Rad Rover. Um, <clears throat> that was about $1,500. I decided to go a completely different route and I decided to build my own. So I've been scouring uh, the you know Craigslist, offer up all those things, looking for a good deal on a fat tire bike. And I recently picked up a Gravity Bullseye Monster. Um, and this is a great fat tire bike. It, it retails for uh, about $1,000 and I managed to pick it up for $225. So I'm really excited about that. Uh, so that's what I'm starting my build with. And so after that, all you have to do is get yourself a motor uh, and a battery um, and you're pretty much good to go. <clears throat> so I've been doing my homework on eBay and all these things, trying to find the best deals that I could find. Um, and I decided to go with a hub motor uh, they're a little bit cheaper and a little bit easier to build. Um, so I was trying to find the best deal that I could and I came across this one by Voila Mart. And this kit was about $160 and then I paid $15 for the two year warranty on it uh, just in case anything goes wrong because frankly we're going to be putting these things through hell. Uh, so here's a quick little unboxing video. Um, I really hope that everything that I ordered is there. Uh, after all, these things are shipping from like China and stuff like that, and the descriptions on eBay are not very good. Um, I'm pretty sure that this would will include an LCD screen, as it showed an LCD screen on uh, the pictures, but uh, it didn't say it in the description, so I really don't know. I'm really hoping it's there. So, uh, so let's see what, uh, what we got and, uh, and how it's packaged. So I got a little ahead of myself and I already cut it open, but the packaging is pretty solid. Um, it had these uh, little plastic straps to make sure that nothing opens up while it's in transit. Um, and then right off the bat, it's got uh, styrofoam blocks uh, holding the rims securely in place on all four sides. So we get those out. And then I'll open these smaller boxes later. I want to get to the motor and, and hub. There's a, a manual here with a uh, pretty crazy military style rig. Some guy with an AR-15 and uh, a cool bike. So I'll go through this later. Okay, so this actually looks like it's pretty good quality. It has uh, color photographs uh, showing tools that you need and things like that. So when I start putting this thing together, I'll, uh, I'll really get into this manual and let you guys know if it's any good. Uh, so there's a bag here that's for the controller. And then here is the hub and the rim. Okay, oh, there's another box down here. We got another small little box. Okay, let's see. So this thing looks pretty, pretty solid. It's got these uh, little covers for the bolts. I think that's just to protect it while it's uh, in transit. But um, yeah, everything looks straight. Doesn't look like anything's bent on that. Uh, so that looks good. And uh, let's see what else we got in here. Oh, cool. So I didn't realize this, but it actually comes with the uh, gear cassette included. 
Uh, I don't know. Alright, so here we have all the electronics. So we've got some some uh, cable tie cover situation thing. I'm not actually sure what all these pieces are, but uh, I don't know what that thing is. So I'm not going to read the manual for that. Alright, here we've got the twist throttle. So this is a twist throttle, not a thumb throttle. I would have preferred a twist, but um, I'm cool with the thumb throttle, or sorry, I would have preferred a thumb throttle, but I'm cool with the twist throttle. Um, and then it has the other grip for the other side that matches. Here we have the brake levers. So these are um, these are made so that when you when you brake, uh, it'll shut off the motor so that uh, you can come to a stop quickly and safely. And then here is the controller. So, you'll notice, is I did not get an LCD. Uh, even though it was in the images, I'm gonna send a message to Walmart um, and see if I can get them to send me uh, the LCD screen because, well, frankly, it was part of the advertisement, so I, I do want one.